Van from Rexdale, Ontario, uh, and I play for the Bubble Bulls in the Ontario Hockey League. I'm Jake Patterson from Mississauga, Ontario, and I play for the Saginaw Spirit. Uh, Jordan Bennington from uh, Gravenhurst, Ontario, and uh, I play for the Owen Sound Attack. I started playing goalie at age, I think, 11, turning 12, and that was for the Toronto Young Nationals and then, uh, for two years, and then I went to the Toronto Marlies after that for another two years, and then after that I went to the Mississauga Reps Midget. Uh, I played for the Toronto Marlboros mostly uh, growing up. You know, they're a great organization back in Toronto. Uh, I played seven years with the Vaughn Kings. So. I started with my dad, uh, obviously uh, all three of our brothers started playing, uh, PK was the first and then after it was me and I started at a really young age, I think uh, three I started playing house league and then I went to Tyke, uh, Topical Bulldogs, so it was really my dad who got us in it, yeah. Um, I don't know, just uh, my dad gave me some skates, I think I was around three, uh, started playing forward and then uh, one day our goalie was away at a wedding and you know for whatever reason I got thrown in between the pipes and uh, I haven't, turned, I haven't uh, looked back since then. Um, I started off as a player and uh, I felt I, I think I was pretty good. I actually don't know, but um, it was where you would rotate a goalie in every game, you know. And I tried it one time, and I, I loved it. I was sliding out everywhere out there. So uh, I, ever since then, I uh, made the switch. Convinced my dad, which took a little bit of time, but uh, ever since then, so I was probably about uh, seven years old, and switched. Uh, just I love to play the game. Uh, every position I love to play. Uh, when I was a player, I love to play every position. I was a defenseman, but. I love to play uh, center, actually. I wasn't too fond of playing winger, but uh, center for sure, just because you can wheel around. Uh, but um, I just wanted to play goaltending because I just had a real, uh, real uh, big passion for it. Um, probably just, you know, I just enjoyed it. I mean, uh, ever since I switched to goalie, I really uh, just enjoyed being out there and, and uh, playing on the Marlies. We were a pretty successful team, so I think uh, that kind of kept me going as well. And, and you know, it's just a uh, love of the game, mostly. As I got older, I think uh, it's, it's the atmosphere hockey brings, you know. Uh, Bringing, being around the hockey players all the time, you meet so many people and everyone's just like, it's like a salute every time you see another hockey player, you get along, you know how, how it is. So uh, I like the people involved in it and uh, the, the feeling of winning, you know, I had the opportunity to win a championship a couple years ago and the amount of uh, friendships I'll have from uh, that year and it would continue for the rest of my life, I think. So it, it's, it's worth it, worth all the hard work and uh, sacrifices. I'd say my dad just because he was my coach. Um, so like him being your coach, you know, he's always hard on you and stuff. So he definitely had the biggest influence on my career. For sure. um, I'd probably say uh, influences my goalie coach was, uh, you know, he kind of taught me pretty much everything I know, Piero Greco. Uh, I mean, outside of him, obviously my parents and uh, I have two older sisters. Uh, one of them played pretty high level hockey. So I always kind of looked up to them and, uh, you know, they kind of got me into hockey originally and, you know, they kind of, you know, kept me interested, obviously. I'd have to say my dad, you know, he's, uh, he's an intense guy, he's, uh, he's always kept me on path and um, taught me the right thing to do, he, he's a huge part of uh, who I am today and uh, he's, he's helped me the whole way, you know, so I guess I'd look up to him throughout my hockey career.